this little uh, diddly because we're going out and about. Where did we go out and about this morning? Well, we went out and about here yesterday for a brief moment to talk about how Mother's Bistro and Bar's new location was getting ready for opening day. That was yesterday. This is a look inside the brand new space there in downtown Portland. We're talking about third and ash, but how about this live picture this morning? Back inside our studio with the mother behind mothers, Lisa Schroeder standing next to me and three hungry news types <laughs> digging in on some food. So Lisa, the easy question up front, what are we eating here this morning? We have our mm. Irish nachos, which is potatoes, bacon, caramelized onions, oh. sour cream and green onion. Oh, yes. We have our Stop. homemade buttermilk pancakes that are moist and tender. And mm. then we have our cornflake crusted French toast. Three items that have always been on the list, yes. or at least have been on the menu for a long time at Mother's. Yeah. Uh, again, I said, Rod, Ashley, and Brenda, feel free to dive in and keep eating. Let's talk about this new space. There's okay. a lot to talk about, but maybe we should start with the big change. You're open basically all the time now. All the time. Like all yesterday. Time? You've never been open on Mondays before. No. Yesterday you opened on a Monday. Explain the differences schedule-wise. Well, we're now in a hotel, so we are open seven days a week, 365 days a year, so you can have mothers any day. I don't think anyone's complaining about that <laughs> new detail <laughs> at all. And while we have some old favorites here in front of us, you That's are going so to bring uh, some new <laughs> items to this new place. We really added a lot of menu items on the dinner menu, so we now have a roasted chicken, a grilled wild salmon with a red wine reduction, linguine and meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was short, but then... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, Rob, when you go to your knees, you basically That's have to be invisible. I love that. Uh, I, I, you bring up a good point there. You mentioned dinner, and I, yes. I once, some, you know, sometimes we write uh, news scripts here, and we'll say yeah. things like uh, a favorite brunch spot right. or a popular breakfast place. Do those mm -hmm. words bother you? Because you are a restaurant that serves dinner as well. That's right, breakfast, lunch, and dinner with an amazing bar. So yes, you really should think of mothers for dinner because we've got motherly favorites like pot roast chicken and dumplings, meatloaf. Meatloaf's Not good. That right, and then we added so these good. bistro That's bowls, so, so healthy no. eating also. I would love uh, some of my coworkers to jump in with any sort of mm -hmm. questioning they'd like so that I can grab a fork and start eating. <laughs> I, I want to add, I'll I'll get you. Go, no, 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 go Brenda, go, 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 go. I was just going to comment, These are the pancakes are like melt in your mouth. Oh, I want your gosh. recipe, would you uh, share? Absolutely, I will, and it's actually, oh I can gosh. share it, I'll send it to Drew if you want to put it on the oh, website. that's perfect. I yes. can do that, it's also in my cookbook. I want to know what your favorite meal is at your restaurant. Oh my goodness, well in the morning, every morning I have to have a taste of our country gravy that goes on the business. It's, it's like my, oh. I, it's my quality <laughs> control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Exactly. So I start my day with a little gravy. I never had the Irish nachos before. Is that what you call them? Yeah. The breakfast nachos? Yeah. Wonderful. Thank Delicious. you. I'm kind of a Thank potato you. guy, though, so I knew oh, this was Oh, well, there work. you go. Who isn't? <laughs> Who what isn't? are you going to ask her? Well, no, so you, this is like in your, in your cookbook as yes. well, but the cornflake. Yeah, we dip it. It makes it crunchy and, and squishy. I like crispy and squishy. I think that goes really well together. And that cornflake crusted French toast is yeah, that. Yeah, it just gives it that little something, something. Can I do one thing? Yes. Can I give... Much love to yeah. your staff because oh, the because waiters and waitresses there, mm. top notch. They absolutely. Always, we, they're we, right on everything. Absolutely. Mm. I could have not have done this move without them. They Aww. were so dedicated there till two in the morning to no, get this wow. done. And who else has a parade to move to another location? <laughs> <laughs> My uh, longtime partner in this news gathering thing, Camera Steve, right. he and I were there on Friday, and it was, it was cool mm. to see those familiar faces in your wait staff. They made the yeah. trip, obviously, from a few blocks down and one block over to your new spot mm. at 3rd and Ash. That's, That's right. And it was just so great having the March 4th band bring the good energy from others. They brought it with them to our new location. That's what that was Congrats, about. That's Last great. question. Uh, obviously, people loved Mothers there at Second and Stark. What are you excited about as far as this new location goes? Well, we're going to probably do a performance space on the corner and let people also rent it out by the day, by the week, by the hour. At the old spot you're talking about. At the about. old spot, and then we're going to have um, Southern Comfort Food in our old Velvet Lounge. But, but I'm saying about the new, new space. space. What's what most exciting? Yes. No weights or very limited weight, okay. and plenty of space to wait if you had to wait. A gorgeous lobby in the hotel if you don't want to be in my yes. restaurant to wait. <laughs> and lots of love. It's okay. all about the love, and it's carried over to the new location. Did Rod escape because he's trying yeah. to tell us that we have to do weather now? I think, I think he does. does. Oh, thank, you. So. Nice thank you. Nice to see you. Thank you. Thank you. So good. Thank you. Loved it. Yummy. All Loved right. it. All right, Rod. Lisa, you drew the short straw.